Hey everybody, Carl Sardelli here for Big Fish with a preview of Greek Gems. One thing right off the bat, you'll notice that Greek Gems is a match two game, meaning you only need to match two gems. The change works out well as it seems to allow for a greater variety of opening moves per board. Similar to other games in this genre, you have to reach a required score to progress in a limited amount of turns. Later on, you also have to drop certain items to the bottom of the board, such as a vase that I was told is where Apollo hides his wine. Also, there are timed events which I really got into because I didn't have to think about turns and I just had to beat the clock, which also brought with it its own kind of madness. I kind of freaked out at my iPad a couple times. The story starts off with someone getting turned into stone and you learning that Apollo has had it with humans and has decided to just end everyone, like ever. You meet the goddess of love, Aphrodite, and find out you're a demigod and told that it's up to you to save humanity. Although the way she frames it, it seems a bit self-serving that the destruction of mankind will inconvenience her dating life. I mean, true, but put things into perspective, lady. If you match five or more gems on the board, you'll get a bonus in the form of a Apollo Blast, Titan Torpedo, or other gem clearing awesomeness. There's also certain levels where you have to destroy tiles in order to progress. And when you beat a board, you get a gift from the gods and unlock the next level on the map. My main strategy of the game was to use power-ups to set off bombs to make chain reactions. One weird thing is that Aphrodite mentions that Apollo likes to throw us power-ups every once in a while to shake things up. Wait, does that mean he's temporarily not killing everyone so he can watch my progress in the game? I mean, he's pretty powerful. I guess he could pull it off, but I'm lucky if I could cook two things on the stove at the same time. I end up burning something. Overall, I dig the wisecrack in Aphrodite, and I like the match 2 gameplay because I feel empowered right away at any stage. So I say check it out. Time to save the universe. And also make sure the Aphrodite doesn't die an old maid. Nobody wants that.